just a little video from here at Woolly Bees. We're always trying to learn and find new and different ideas and techniques to be a beekeeper. This one started out as an accident and I plugged the front entrance. There's a video somewhere. I'll throw the link down here in the description of where I made mason jar high beetle traps, which as you can see there's high beetles in there that works pretty well. But you cut the mason jar hole, you staple the metal rim in and you just put a piece of eighth inch hardware cloth over it screw your little mason jar in bees chase the bee, uh, beetles down in it and they cook in the sun behind it well this one fell out and that's when I decided to plug up the front entrance and see what beetle control would happen with this one well ladies and gentlemen all summer long there has not been one beetle been found in this in this hive right here. So I've made a couple more bottom boards this way with no front entrance whatsoever because the theory behind it is is beetles cannot hover. I've got a couple of hives that I've tried this year with PVC portal entrances, no other entrance, not a beetle one in either one of those. As you can see, this is just a five frame deep nuke. The other one is a 10 frame deep nuke. At one point it had three honey supers on it. The other one is an eight frame deep, double deep. One time it had three honey supers on it. Not the first beetle in it. As you can see, look at all that pollen coming in and everything, but yeah. We're gonna be giving this a wider variety of try next year. As always, like and subscribe. That way you get a notification every time the videos come out, which I do a little learning video every once in a while and always trying new and different things. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.